Hi guys, welcome back to 0% Pointy and this week we're doing something a little bit different. We're going to tell you how to connect one of these to a Samsung Note 10 or Note 10 Plus. That's right, if you haven't got an earphone socket and you want to record external audio, this is how to do it. <laughs> Welcome back guys, how are we doing? Um, obviously not a drink review this week, it's something a little bit different. Before starting up 0% Pointy, you can hear the boiler in the background, it doesn't matter, it's fine, who cares? Um, before starting up 0% Pointy, I went on a massive journey of exploration to find how on earth I could connect an external microphone. Obviously there's loads of different types, it's just a, a cheapo compressor mic, which does actually improve the sound quality because it brings the microphone closer to me whilst I'm recording. Um, again, a couple of quid, I think it was about six pounds off Amazon, came with a tripod. But of course, on the other end, we've only got 3.5 millimeter jack, indeed. Now, this will not connect straight into a uh, Samsung Galaxy Note 10, because it won't, it just won't. That, that's fact, it will not. Uh, I don't know whether we've got one available. We have not. Anyway, um, I will put a picture of it somewhere around here. There is a Samsung endorsed uh, connector that goes from the Type C connection on the bottom of the phone to a 3.5 millimeter jack. Don't bother wasting your money on it. It doesn't work. I bought one. Yes, it works for earphones. So if you do just want to listen to uh, music through your headphones, through decent different headphones that aren't completely wireless, then that is the way to do it. Also, you can get type c headphones with the type c connector on the end already uh, and you can even get which i did buy at great expense a type c microphone which plugs straight into the phone however the sound quality was atrocious and i couldn't hear a thing there was feedback it was ridiculous so i carried on hunting we've bought several different things we've bought three to four pin adapters for 3.5 millimeter jacks to go into different adapters that go from type c to yeah, 3.5 millimeter jacks. It, it, it's just absolute garbage. I think in total I probably spent around 70 or 80 pounds. Don't worry if my wife's watching this, I did get refunds for 90% of it. Anyway, eventually I'd given up. I thought, you know what, forget it. And if you look at earlier on in the videos that I did uh, here on 0% point T, the sound quality was okay. It was okay. Luckily, the onboard microphone in the Note 10 is half decent. Um, but this is what you've come here to see. This is the answer. This is hopefully the click base that you've all been waiting for. How to connect a microphone. Uh, obviously, the phone itself doesn't have the DAC, which is Data Audio Converter, I think, which is which is what Samsung told me. Um, it doesn't have, they took that out of the new phones. I don't even think that the, the, the S20 will have it. I don't think the Note, uh, the, the S10 has it either, but don't quote me on that. All I know is for sure that the Note 10 and the Note 10 Plus doesn't support external audio. So how do we connect it? So eventually after giving up completely, I saw this little bad boy. Yes, just hold it up to the camera there. This is a USB to twin audio splitter. So the red is microphone, the green is earphone, two 3.5 millimeter jacks with a USB standard on the front there. Now this is aimed to work at laptops uh, or, or MacBooks or whatever that you obviously want earphone and microphone inputs for um, because it's just a laptop and it might not necessarily come with those inputs or you might only have one and you want to split earphones and microphones input and output maybe you've got decks you want to have a mixing software on there or something all of those uh, apps and programs made possible with this but how did we get it onto the phone wow i thought hold on a minute I can get a USB connection onto my phone because in the box with your mobile phone device you get a USB to USB-C data converter or connector or whatever you want to call it. Uh, I think it's OTG, but they, used, they just sometimes just call it a USB connector. Anyway, this comes in the box. They're available for a couple of quid off Amazon and eBay just in case um, you haven't already got one or you bought a phone that wasn't in the box. Links for these in the description below and of course for this as well. And also just to make it really snazzy because my phone's in a super beefy case and these don't like plugging into the phone usually, I bought a right angle type C converter as well. So that plugs in nice and neatly and that brings the phone uh, away from the connector. So we simply plug that into that, we simply plug that into that, 
we simply plug the microphone into this and then we connect it to the phone. Job done. Anyway, do you reckon it'll let me do it before or do you reckon it'll stop recording? Oh, and there we go. All of a sudden, a completely different audio experience, all from the external microphone. Fantastic. And don't worry, if anybody wants to use this for ASMR, just make sure that they don't follow me because I don't want to see it. Anyway, take care, everybody. Little informational video for you there from 0% Pointy. Don't forget to go and check out my other videos, which are, of course, about drinking food mostly. But thanks for coming. Thanks for seeing us here today and things. <clears throat> anyway, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks very much for viewing. And it's been emotional. Yeah.